possible. Okay. All right. Uh, I got one more I want to do because the distance what ifs aren't as good. I, we could do those next time if we want, but yeah. the distance ones were not as interesting to me. So I got one more sprint one. Uh, or you have one more sprint one that you added. Also said I'll read. Uh, what if a thing Mo and Shamir Little ran the four hundred, and also uh, Christine Mboma and Beatrice Masalingi, who were not allowed to run it and had to run the two hundred, but Mboma went and won a uh, silver medal in that two hundred. So what if basically what what if the four hundred had these four other athletes who are all capable of running 48, 49 mid, um, all the way down to 48 high, probably. Potentially. So let's start with Mo. Let's start with Mo. I think, I think Mo would have won the 400 because seeing how she split in that four by four, you know, this is assuming Mo runs a 400 fresh, not with an 800 in her legs for the record. Um, I think Mo would have won. I think she's that talented. And we would have had a very similar kind of deja vu moment for Shawnee Miller Weibo, where she runs out of her mind but still gets second. Right? I think we could have had. She'd be like, "Damn, I run forty eight three, and it's still not enough to win." When she, you know, lost in twenty nineteen. Mm. So I think that happens. I think also the the addition of the two DSD athletes would make it even faster. And I think that would obviously affect Allison Felix, right? She got third. The we'd be talking about it a little differently. I mean, she still would have got her medal in the in the four by four. But if we add in Mo and Christine and Boma, you like I don't think Allison Felix gets third. Do you think she still gets third? Adding all those people, knowing what they did, be like in these games, yeah, no, it would have been, it de definitely would have been tough. I mean, you can only race the people that are there. I think. Let's back up for a second here, though. You made a huge assumption. What did a thing most split in the four x four? Uh, forty-eight-seven. I don't know what is what is she split. I could be wrong. I think I've made that up somewhere. Forty-eight-seven. She's what did Shawnee Miller seconds. Weibo run in the open? What did Shawnee Miller run in the open? Okay. 48 3. Okay. Yeah. Well, all right. You're, okay. I think Mo was by herself running, doing a tone time trial, and she had just run 155 in an 800. So, yeah. I think, I think Mo would have ran 48 2 or 1, I think. That would have been Dude, a big jump. Was good, I'm man. still. You're off the. I, I didn't off, say she is. You're leaving the thing motion, so and I'm back. I'm on it. Come on. No, you're just no, 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 no. The price of admission to this train isn't that I have to give her every gold medal in every single event. She just won the the 800 meter gold medal. Obviously, she's amazing. But I'm saying putting her ahead of Shawnee Miller Weibo is a, a bit of a leap, given what Shawnee Miller Weibo ran that day. I think the interesting, the the wild cards, the the, the interesting would have been like Mboma because what she ran that world junior record this year what was it 40 i'm blanking on the time right now 4854 she ran this year so that was only two tenths off what miller Weibo ran so that would have been nuts to see uh that race because it would have been it would have been very very close but i think i think Mo's very good she's obviously top three in the united states in the 400 but i i would put her behind shauna miller Weibo for for the time being and i hope that she gets to do it soon because i looked gordon i already looked ahead at the schedule for eugene and the double is not possible in the 2022 world championships how is it not possible you might ask they have them going back to back one night the 400 women's 400 and making, women's 800 are back to back i thought they were making every double possible in 2022 no didn't you talk about that we're like oh they made they every double possible no they lied to us gordon they we've been led astray by this um I think it's a semi and a 400 and a final. It's a final in one and then a semi in the other. And it's literally back to back. So there's no way it's going to happen. So that's oh, terrible. Hopefully that's they change awful. it. Oh, yeah. Hopefully they change it. I don't think they will because people are already buying tickets. But I would strongly but encourage yeah. it. And by the time. The, the problem is, though, by the time they do decide, they're like, we'll change it for 2024. It's like all the people are different. Yeah. You don't know if it's even worth doing. Maybe another double pops up that's possible. It's like, have one schedule. It makes all the doubles possible and keep it the same keep so everybody knows what to expect. Yes, yes.